Well, like with other eating problems, the m most important thing I can say about uh, recovering from bulimia nervosa, or the number one tip for recovering from bulimia nervosa, is to try to get help from somebody experienced with dealing with these types of eating problems. Sometimes that means an individual counselor or therapist. Sometimes that means getting help from a more structured treatment center that can provide even round-the-clock supervision for breaking the cycle of binge eating and purging. So that would be the number one tip, and sticking with the recovery process and not giving up even though there are bumps in the road would be sort of recovery tip number two. There are also some self-help um, guides that folks with bulimia nervosa can use that are rooted in good science, so rooted, for example, in good sound cognitive behavioral principles um, that can be incredibly helpful to people. And actually, self-help has been tested in some scientific studies as an alternative to more formalized treatments. Ultimately, uh, with formalized treatments, cognitive behavioral therapy with a therapist really being superior, but self-help can be helpful in some cases. Um, there is one expert in the field of eating disorders, Christopher Fairburn, who has written a book called Overcoming Binge Eating, which is one example of uh, a self-help guide that's really rooted in good science of psychotherapy uh, that can help people get better from bulimia nervosa and present some of the same principles that you would receive in a treatment. Of course, nothing takes the place of working with a professional in a treatment setting to move forward in the process of recovery. Thank you.